What is up guys, Video Game Jan Poop here, back with, again with more Super Mario Sunshine. In the last episode we have uh, beaten Noki Bay, uh, all shines, uh, even the secret ones. In this episode we're going to go to this last area on top of this um, Shine Sprite statue. And we're going to see what's in here. So it's similar to the Serena Beach one. But in here, we have Payanta Village. And episode one is Chain Chomplets Unchained. And in the Japanese version, the uh, place is called Monte Village, which is the Japanese name for uh, Pianta, and that means mountain in Italian. So here's Pianta Village, and it's night time. And by chomplets, we have baby chain chomps. Just gonna spray, spray water at them. Then you grab their tails, and then you can launch them. And then, boom! They get slingshot all the way over there. Yeah, and you need to send them to the water over there. Okay. Uh, they will go back on fire eventually, but still. Are they in the water? Oh, they're not in the water yet, but it doesn't matter. But you have to launch them in the water, which is here. Yeah, and if you hear that sound, and then they get there, they're in the water. Yeah, you have to just pull their tails, yep, animal cruelty, and then just put them in that water right over there. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. And then we're just gonna put them in that water. Slingshot and BOOM! I need to refill my water. And just one more over there. Alright, there we go. Just gonna pull them really tight. So they go over there. You notice there's orange goop now. Oh, wow! All the way over there. Might not make it. No, I didn't. Yeah, the orange goop is fire. So if you touch it, you'll burn yourself. You know, all know how dangerous that is. Where's he gone? Where, where is he? Oh, he's over there. Alright, there we go. We're gonna turn around. Turn around! And put him in the water so he can try! Remember always to be kind to your pets. Indeed. And then we get a shine for doing it to all of them. On top of a mushroom. <laughs> put them in the same position as well. Oh my god. <laughs> hold on, I need, uh, hold on, uh, hold on, I need to, I need to picture this. There we go. Okay, uh, we got that. <laughs> so, uh, we got that as a screenshot, I can show to my friends, if I want. And then we're just gonna get the shine. We have 72 shines. Right, here we go. Alright then, so... I feel the again, and we're back on top here. Alright then. Hold on. Yeah, we can go in there again. And then episode 2 is the one and only Eopientissimo's Crazy Climb. Yep, this is the last time we'll be racing him. Your thought will be uh, most stages episode five, but no, in this one it's just episode two, and it's daytime this time. It's you, uh, the stage is unique, so it has this world is unique, so it has like uh, some place, some episodes are nighttime and some are daytime. It's me, Pietissimo, and now listen, see that flag over there? Of course I do, with a lady dancing. <laughs> Oh, 
No, you and I shall race yourself to the fastest, yes. The personal record is 30 seconds. Impressive, huh? But you're at first ready. Get the ring and ready, send and go! Okay then. Right then, so. Again, we've just got a race. And it's on top of this tree this time. Which, if you know how to run, you just gotta do a dive on the slope and then boom. 21 seconds and 32 milliseconds! <laughs> wow, okay. Grr, yes, grr! That was not so bad! You are quick, yes! I suppose maybe I underestimated it a small bit, perhaps. You try again, I have to have a small. Until then. Goodbye! Farewell, Italian boy! Alright then. <laughs> so long, Flutter's going. Oh yeah, and fun fact, uh, Yumpion Tismo actually has a, um, actually has a face underneath his mask, and it's actually very similar to, um, the Running Man from Ocarina of Time and the Postman from Majora's Mask, which are both Zelda games. Uh, if you, uh, if you, uh, if you go in models and then you can find, and if you see his face then, boom. The Gooey Inferno, though this one is unique because of this. Recognize this? Steals Flood. And... You have to rescue Flood. So you have no Flood in this one. And even if you replay it, you still won't have Flood. Meaning you can watch the cutscene over again. You have these uh, guys as well. So the way I do this... The way I do this episode... Uh, there's also... There's a lot of goop here. Making it hard. But I... Go on that tree. Oh yeah, if you go like this, you're essentially soft locked. And it's an instant death. So don't do this if you're trying to do this. That's the only part that's really hard, but still. But yes, you have no flood in that episode at all. And it's the only episode besides secret stages where you have no flood at all. And you have to rescue him. It's the only one to do this. At all. So, yeah. Which is the Goofy Inferno. Yeah, and even if you want to replay it later, you'll still have no flood until you rescue him again. It's the same thing if you do it over and over again. So, meaning you can watch the cutscene again, if you want to see it. So, yeah, the cutscene where Shadow Mario steals a uh, flood. Yeah, you can watch- Oh, no! But wait, we're not so- Oh, yes, we are. Damn you! Like, we finished Noki Bay, but it still shows that cutscene. Like, come on. Are you serious? Alright, then. We don't need to see Mario falling into the abyss and then, uh, realize that he lost his, his boy Flood. Okay. But yeah, I, I go on this tree right here. Let's see if I can do it this time. We have to get close to the edge of the platform. So that we then go on the edge. And then, we go up the tree. Then I go up the tree. Like this. And then... Not like that! So you do have to be careful. Let's practice that again, actually. Alright then. <laughs> okay, we got that. I'm just gonna go all the way up here. And then I'm gonna go on this leaf. Which, it's not the right way, I know. But to get to this leaf... And not No! Why? The, the leaf is not a hard wall! Come on, Mario! Okay, guys, so I decided to use this leaf. Uh, and then we're gonna wall jump to this leaf right here. And then, boom, we just stand on it. 
And then we're actually close to that platform. So then I just spin jump all the way over there. And then boom! Okay, but just a bit of lag there, but still, for some reason. But besides that, it's easy as pie if you do it this method. Uh, if you're doing other methods, it's really hard. So, oh no! This goddamn lag. You can watch the goop if you want, but obviously we're not going to do that. So, we just need to go up here. gonna clean this dude. Speak to him. Woo, you saved me, fancy bundle. Then we get a shine. And that's that stage out of the way. There we go. Alright then. 74 shines. Isn't that good? Alright then, so uh, let's go back in. And it is a, it'll be another daytime one. So it's going to be night, day, night, day, night, day, night, day. It's going to be like in Piazza Village. So, episode 4 Chain Chomp's Bath. Yes, there's Chain Chomp in this game. But only once. And it's here, but it's orange. Uh, chain chomps are never orange for some reason. However, it is blue when you wash it. It's like those baby chomplets. Wait, no, the, the, the chain chomplet, the chain chomplets, where you would spray him to then eventually make him this, and then you have to pull him just to get to the bath. Well, it does not seem to be like bathing. Right then. Then, but unlike the chomplets, it can easily go back even when you're carrying it. So we can pull him again. Well, I'm not over there. This way. Yes. This way. Go this way. Well, we were going fast. Come on, he's all the way over there. But wait. Oh, no, he's going this way. Don't you dare go that way. I've run out of water! No! But hey, if, we, if he comes here, we can uh, spray him then. Oh, there's no water here. God damn it. Why am I going to get water? I have to get it from the back. You notice these arrows as well. You need to take the chain chomp here. Into this water. Right here. seem to be avoiding you, Mario. Who's they, Flood? Where is he? There he is. Oh, and he's close to the bath as well. This will be a piece of cake. Come on. There we go. Pull him and get him in the bath. Come on. He might turn back into the fire again. Okay, we got him. Oh, we nearly ran out of water, but we can get them again. We have to be careful here. 
And then boom, we got it. Oh, no, we haven't. No! Okay, spray in. Okay, it's fully sprayed. No, 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 not that way. This way, this way, this way. Okay, come on. And we need to get him in this bath. Boom! There we go! He's in his bath now! <laughs> Alright. Alright then. There we go, we got it. <laughs> Flood's doing that thing again. 75 shines. Nice. There we go. Boom. We got this. And then Chain Chomps could just do the buff. So we can um eventually get there. Whoa, I thought I was gonna fall. Oh! Fell, but still. Episode 5 is Secret of the Village on the Side. Yep, this is the hardest secret in the game. First, you see a Yoshi egg. You're gonna need Yoshi for this. Uh, getting to it is easy, but it's the actual course itself that's hard, and I'll show you why in a moment. So, Yoshi wants a pineapple. Okay. Alright then. Let's uh, get him a pineapple then. Which should be up here. Oh, that's a durian. Oh, there we go. There's a pineapple. Okay. Right then. Uh, we can just go down here. There we go. Then, here we go. There's the... There's the uh, shiny Yoshi. The orange Yoshi. It doesn't matter what colour you have. But you need to go down here where there's mushrooms. And oh boy, this is slightly difficult just for that. But it is sort of, it is easy. It is a little bit hard, but still. It's the actual course that's the hardest. Now, now there's, why is, why is there a mushroom over there? Can we eat it? No, we can't. That's unfortunate. But there are two mushrooms over there, though. Okay, we need to spray that, though. So then, we can access it. But let's get those two. So let's just get those. Right then, and then let's get that over there. The boom. Got that. And then let's just go inside there. Again, we lose Flood. Now, this is the hardest one because, you know, it's Piantas here. And you need them, because they do this. You speak to them. Homer chucks them, and they throw you. Now, I'm saying it's hard because you could get easily, you can easily die if you're not careful. So be careful with this. And it depends on the position as well. Uh, the small ones are sort of worst. So... You gotta be careful with this. Go back! Yeah, I died because of that! So, it is the hardest one in the game. So far. But thankfully, there is a mushroom here, but it'll be hard to get because of that Pianta. And even if you're doing red coins, it's still hard as well. You'll still need some of the Piantas. We need to make this small piano to talk to us at the end. Okay, we need to wait. We need to wait for him to go to the edge. We have to talk to him at a very specific angle. Not that way! Come on! Like I said, it's the hardest one in the game. Just because of this. And you'll die a lot. Because of the angle of the Piantas, how they throw you. 
Like, you could do some skills here, but still. Oh, wow. That was uh, impressive. Let's try this big one again, but this time when he's far away. I bet he'll still throw me over. Oh, no, he don't. Okay. And then this one... He'll just throw you above. So over there. Oh, what? Oh, no! But it's sort of hard because you won't know where you land. There we go. We have to land in there. And then go at Pacific Angle. With the oh, no! Damn it! Oh, I wanted to jump. But, but the Pianta was there, so it took me instead. Thankfully, it is sort of short, though. At least it's the only one with, it, at least it's the only secret stage with Piantas in it. So, um, yeah, you have a bonus there, sort of. And plus, I think this is the only one with blue coins as well. Come on, don't chuck me over there. There we go. Right, we'll just talk to him. Gotta be careful. I'm trying to not get shot. But they spawn every time, so... Okay, there we go. Should get chucked over there like that. This one is the hardest. Because of the position you have to be in. So, you can go over there as well, but... But the shine's this way, so... It's necessary to just go this way. Now, this one is very hard. So, it's recommended to simply wait on this uh, line here, and then just wait for him to come. Plus, even doing the red coin mission, it's hard as well. And you can see over here, there's a one on fire, and that will give you a blue coin if you spray it. You need to wait for him to go exactly in the middle. Okay, hold on. I'm trying to make a good person. Oh, I missed! God damn it. Okay, let's. Oh, no! Okay, let's try this again, guys. Could try this angle. Could try this angle. Let's see if that works. Uh, no. Oh, so close! Okay, please do this for me. Come on. Okay. Come on. Yes! Yes! Especially on my zeroth life. Oh my god, that was so hard. Oh my god. But we only have to do this uh, just two more times. One for the red coins and again for the blue coins. So... Besides that, that is it. We are done with that. But I have zero lives now because of this. Thankfully, I didn't get a game of- Oh! I almost fell. So, we're gonna go in and go into episode 6. And it's called, Pianta's in Need. You've got a Pianta in Need! Do, 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 do. <laughs> okay, then. And they're sucked in goop. Oh no! I just went away for a bit and now I look! I can't believe it! Another fine mess and it's, it's a doozy! Some of the villagers are, are, are trapped in that burning ooze. And I just finished evacuating everyone a little while back. What in the world's happening? I think I must uh, just start crying. I'm so sorry to trouble you after time, but please, could you find time to help us out again? Ten villagers are trapped in the slime. You must hurry. So we have two minutes. Well, actually three minutes. To clean up some goop. 
from the Pian of the Piancers. And they're all here. On spraying. There we go. Yeah, we have the small ones as well. Yeah, I think some of these give you blue points as well. I don't know if it's the small ones. Yeah, I think it is the children. I think these are children. I don't know. Might be. <laughs> okay then. Uh, there's one there. Sometimes I do struggle to find one more, but let's see if we can get them on time. There's another one there. And it's a female one. Okay, that one's clean. some this way as well but we need some more water so some there as well as one there as well there we go and there's one more and I think it's this way and I think it's over here might be wrong. Wait, no, I think it's there. Yeah, it's over there. No! Okay, then. And there we go, we're done! 45 seconds left. Wow. Uh, that one's actually easy. And we just need to go back to him. And speak to him. Come on, talk to him. Oh my, he runs. There we go. You're the savior of Pianta Village. We are indeed. As a reward, please take this. Okay, then. Our shine sprite. Alright, then. Now, the seventh episode is another Shadow Mario one, but I'm not going to do that one yet because that will trigger something in Delfino Plaza. So instead, I'm going to get the red coin uh, the red coin secret in the secret stage, and maybe a few Pianta... Uh, Pianta uh, Delfino Plaza secret shines as well. So, that one's called Shadow Mario Runs Wild, but we're not going to do that one yet. And the other secret here is in the last episode of this, and we cannot do it after... Episode 7, uh, early, so we're gonna go to the secret, and I'll meet you there. Okay, we're here, so we can finally get the shine. And also, there is a uh, one-up mushroom up here. You could also get it with the Pianta, but I just prefer to do it this way. That way it's easier. And yes, I did get those other uh, one-ups as well, so so let's get the red coins. There's one on top of this Pianta, uh, but you don't need the Pianta to get it. You can just do it like this. And boom, you got it. Uh, let's try and not use many Piantas. And let's just try and use... Um... Of course we'll use the ones to get us high and such, but let's not use the ones that send you forward, so we're not risking a death then. Let's uh, hope I don't die here. Okay, there's two red coins here. Okay, there's another red coin there, along with the fire guy. Alright then. Uh, again, we're not going to do the fire guy because he gives us a blue coin. I think he does. I might be wrong, actually. I don't know. I mean, if I don't see another red coin somewhere, then... Mm. 
Nah, yeah, he gives you blue coin. Oh, come on, I missed. But we can do this. Wow. Okay. But we can do this, though. But we'll get that one up again. So then... There we go. And then... So then we get this one going. Then. And then we're gonna go here. So we go over there. Don't die, please. No! Oh my boy, what is up with you? Oh my god, that is hard. Got that. I'm glad that ground pound sends you slightly high in order to reach it, so that's good. Again, we can get the red coin like this. Come on, it's just facing the other way, that's the issue. For getting it. And we can get this red coin. We don't need these piantas anymore. We can just, uh, do this with useful uh, skills. Oh, oh. What? What did I just hear? Why did I hear that sound? What just happened? I don't know. I don't understand what happened. Yeah, I don't understand what happened. We'll get that red coin first. So this one's out of the way. Yeah, I don't know why that sound played, but... One. One. Just get these. And then... Then... There we go! And then we just need to get that blue coin next time, but we can easily get that. So, we don't need to worry about it for now. But for now, uh, the secret shine is done here, so, yes! Good! Good! Take that, secret courses. No more of you. <laughs> like I said, uh, we're going to do some secrets in Delfino Plaza now, so... We're not going to do that Shadow Mario thing yet. So we're going to do a few uh, Delfino Plaza. So the first one, and the reason I do these separately, instead of uh, rather than the standard Delfino Plaza ones along with them, is because I class them as so something different. You know why? Well, because of the design of the courses. You see there's a green pipe up here. And then that takes you, and that takes you to the sky levels, which I call Delfino Heavens. With this one, you just need to slide all the way down until you reach the shine, which is easy. Boom! A simple shine to get. That one was easy. We have 79 shines now, so that's a good. I used to actually call these stages uh, Skyrim. Not Skyrim, like the Elder Scroll game. Uh, but I used to call it Skyrim with an N at the end, and not the N at the end. But I now call it Delfino Heavens. The other one we can get, uh, we have to use the turbo nozzle for this. Yeah, and you have to use the turbo nozzle to get there. Is, you know where those policemen are now? And there's a door there. 
and you must go there. And then you have to another one. Right. And this time you still have the turbo nozzle. And you have to basically jump over Ah, oh, damn it. You basically have to jump over these platforms and get to the end that way. I recommend not moving at all. So then you're in a straight position. So you just jump like this. Okay, oh, for some reason it did that, but it doesn't matter. There's more water here. Just jump again. And then one more time to eventually claim your shine. Oh, I failed! Damn it! But you do it like that. There is one of these stages that is very hard. In fact, two of them, actually. And I'm going to die a lot. So, and I think some of you might know what this is. Right, get on there. Oh, come on! I think it's because of the my inputs on the Switch. That's why I'm struggling so badly. But besides that, it is very easy. And I always get this on first try! I forgot to press the A button. Oh, I got a game over. Okay, let's hope we get it this time. Come on. Oh, I pressed it too soon. Okay, we're going to get it. Oh, yes, we did. We got it now. And we have 80 shines. Nice. 80 shines. Do -do 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 -do. We have 80 shines. Do -do 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 -do. Alright, so the other one we can get um, is, in fact, no, we use, we're going to use the rocket nozzle for this, not the silver nozzle, so um, is right here, and this one is one of the worst in the game, and some of you might know what this is. And it is the controversial Pachinko Machine. Oh boy. This is the hardest one in the game. So far, at least. Only because some red coins require a lot of, uh, a lot of practice. And some, like the much further ones, are hard to get. Like, even if you simply do that. Like, I got that one easily, thankfully. But it's that green one that's hard. Even with the rocket nozzle. Oh, God damn it. Whoa, that was weird. Okay, then. So this, I, w I, may, I, might, I don't know if I might get this on first try though. Let's see. Oh, I got that one. Yes. And then we can get the later ones. The later ones are going to be difficult. So we're going to try and get them. Oh my god. These are very hard. Okay, I'm gonna do this. Dive! But I went to the first one again. It's even hard with the hover nozzle as well, sort of. Like, to use the hover nozzle in this, you'll have to use one of the boats that you would find in the game. You know, the ones that float around Delfino Plaza, you would use them to get there and then use a spin jump or just jump and then boom, you're there. Oh no! 
No! We failed! No! Let's try this again. Okay. Again, we still have the rocket nozzle when I didn't want it. Oh, no! Come on! Why is this so hard? Come on, Nintendo. Why did you make the hardest stage possible? At least I'm doing this now and not later. So then I don't have to do it ever again. Oh, what? No, I have zero lives. No. Okay, now I have the hover nozzle now, so we can easily do this. Sort of. Okay, so just do a slight hover in. Oh, no! No! Again, I will struggle with this a lot because it's very hard. It's never easy. Uh, you could do this on first try, but it, but it depends on your skills. On how good they are. Like, come on! Why? Why? Why did they slip this under the radar and put this in the final game? It's even in the Japanese release as well, for Japanese players, or those that want to experience the Japanese version. It's still there. Hey, I'm gonna get that one easily, though. Oh wait, I can actually get this one easily. Oh no, I can't now, because of that sliding mechanic that they put there. Damn it. Oh, wait. We'll get this one. And we could get this. Oh, no. Why? Come on. Why is this in the game? Like, come on. It's so hard. Oh, wait, we landed in here. This is where the shine usually spawns. Let's try and uh, get this one like this. Oh, I missed. Damn it. You could get them like this, but it is very hard. Okay. So far, so good. But I'm gonna slip yet again. Oh, I missed! Damn it! Okay. Got this so far. And you cannot backtrack. At all. Oh, wait. You could get this. Oh, no! Damn it! No! No! It's so hard! I bet I'm gonna die here because of this obnoxious level that for some reason got by got by Nintendo and put it in the final game. Like, come on, because it has a gravity mechanic as well here that shouldn't be there. Okay. And it's very hard to bypass it. Like, come on. Why? Oh, that was so close. But, unfortunately, it's always slidey this slope. And a lot of stars come out. For no reason. Oh, god damn it. Oh, I could have made it! Oh, at least it made it in this one, though. Come on. Oh! 
Oh, I got that one! Yes! I got that one! Wow! You can do it like this, but it is hard. And there's no way to refill your water either. So that's fun. At least we got that one. And that one. We just need one more and it's on that green one. Right then. Come on. Oh, come on! Alright, so we're gonna have to... Do it like this. Oh my god. I'm gonna struggle with this a lot. Oh no! No! I'm dead! No! For that last- Come on! Like, even if you push forward here, it's still not gonna matter because you're still gonna end up going forward. So, it's very hard. And I, I just- I thought I'd do this one now so I could get this one out of the way. Oh, come on! No! And when you- when you're down there, there's no way to survive. Like, Nintendo made the most difficult stage in the game. Like, another one is difficult as well, but this one is the worst. And I might as well do this one first. Like, come on! Why is gravity up there so strong, but not up here? Again, we can get this one easily. There we go. So we got those two. So we don't have to worry about going below now. Like, that is hard. Like, you're never gonna survive most of the time. Like, I almost died there, but still. Come on. Okay, I got that one, finally. We just need uh, that top one and then the other green one. And then that's it. And we're done for this level. We could damn this to hell. Come on. No, I missed. If I got it that way, then I could get the shine easily with that method. Okay, get in there. Yes! Got the shine! Well, we need to get to it, of course. Or we could try this method. Okay. Ah, oh, I missed. But yeah, I guess you could do that method, but we'll have to do the hard one instead. But let's try it, though. One, two, three, go. Get in there. Come on. Get away. Oh! Oh, no! Am I stuck? Oh, no! I'm soft-locked. I'm stuck! Come on! Why? I'm taking a video of this. Why? No! When I've successfully got the shine, this happens. Come on! I'm completely soft locked. I can't get out either. But oh oh! That was strange. I'm taking a video of that. That was actually cool. 
But still, oh my god. I just had to mash my buttons and then I got to it. Oh my god. Okay. That will do for today's episode, guys. So, um, next time we will do more um, Delfina Plaza secrets, which one is up there. Right there. And then the other, well, the other's not down here. I'm just uh, getting this to place my life. But the other is you need Yoshi. And I'm going to do a glitch for the next one. Instead of the intended method. But that will be that will be a story the next episode. So next time we'll do those. And we might do the Pianta Village in the last episode of that. And do that Shadow Mario one. And then we should see that uh, new thing that Delphina Plaza will have. So I'll see you guys next time. So bye!